Hi, my name is Spencer from wakemakers.com. I'm going to show you how to replace the impeller in your Japsco ballast puppy pump. There are three screws in the uh, front of the pump to take off the, the cover. So this will probably be done inside your boat, not on a table. Usually you don't remove the pump. Usually you can do the, the whole thing right in the boat. So remove these three screws. That will uh, allow you to take the plate off. And as you can see, on the inside, you have the impeller. Uh, the blade should always be uh, facing uh, clockwise. Um, and then you have the O-ring around the outside. So when you first take the cover off, you're going to want to inspect the O-ring, make sure that it's good, you're not having any uh, leaks that uh, might cause the pump to uh, not work correctly. I like to use a pick to get in there. I basically just get underneath the impeller and pop it out, straight out, and uh, yeah, you will have some residual water inside there that uh, will uh, probably come out when you take the impeller out. This is the new impeller, uh, green impeller, uh, seems to be working really well with the Japsco ballast puppies. And uh, as you can see, the shaft has a, uh, a slot for the uh, keyway for the, uh, the impeller so it slides on there and doesn't spin freely basically just put that in there and slide it in make sure all the blades are good and make sure they're all facing that clockwise position and then make sure your o-ring is seated and put your cover back on And remember to uh, tighten all of these screws uh, to get a good seat against the O-ring so that you don't have any air leaks. And other than that, uh, you're good to go. Enjoy your ballast system.